Earlier, we studied that a scale is an alphabetical arrangement of eight notes, beginning and ending with the same note, for example, from C to C, or D to D, etc. But each note has a function, a degree, in a scale and can be given its own technical name regardless of where it is written or played. So the first degree note is what they call the tonic. Now you've heard you've heard me use that word before. So if it was like uh, if it was from C to C, the tonic would be C, right? Um, the second degree is what they call the super tonic. Man, my computer overheats. <laughs> um, the third degree is what they call the median. Median. Fourth degree is the sub dominant. Fifth is the dominant. Sixth is the sub median. Seventh would be the leading note. And lastly, the eighth would be, you, you could call it the tonic again, right? Or you could call it the, um, the octave. Octave. And I'll, I'll put in parentheses, or tonic, right? Um, now, the notes or degrees of a scale are numbered in Roman numerals based on their particular function. Um, of all the degrees in a scale, some have more important functions than others. And let me list those out. So, first off, um, importance. Hmm. There we go. Um, now, the, the, the first uh, important uh, degree and the most important note of any scale is the first degree um, because it gives the name to the key. It's both the lowest and highest tone of the scale. So, so provides the name of key. Um, now, the the uh, an, another important degree would be the median. Okay, the third degree. Now, the median is also important because it's the middle note between the tonic and the dominant, and it, it determines whether or not the scale is major or minor. <clears throat> so, determines whether or not the scale is major or minor. Now that leads me to the third important degree <clears throat> would be the dominant. Now the dominant is important because it, it, uh, well, the, the word dominant comes from Latin dominus, meaning master. So the chord built on the dominant is so strong that it masters the key. So um, chord masters the key. Right? And the last, the last um, important note I want to I um, allude to is. Uh, the, the seventh one, the leading note. Now, th this this degree is um, it's also necessary in order to identify the the key. It's always a semitone below the tonic and leads directly to it. Uh, this, the the seventh scale degree is referred to as subtonic only when the distance between it and the tonic is a tone apart. But uh, that's sort of a an asterisk for for later. Um, Actually, I could put that down, right? So, referred to as subtonic only when one tone apart from the tonic. The tonic, right? Um, yeah, so the leading note, right? It 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 uh, uh, is usually um, 
one semitone below the E tonic. Now the names of the other degrees are based on where they are placed in the scale and are secondary to the primary degrees mentioned here. Right? If I could list them in importance, I would probably go this one, this one, this one, and this one. That's it for now.